the last 48 hours. Political temperature has risen in Delhi's chilly corridor, with back-to-back -back meetings between the BJP President and Home Minister Amit Shah, as well as front runners meeting with the BJP top brass. The suspense as to who will become the Chief Minister of the three states, where the BJP took a gamble not to project a regional face, has only intensified. Vasundra Raje arrived in Delhi yesterday, stating that she had come to meet her daughter-in-law. Later, she visited J.P. Nadar's home and held an 80-minute discussion with the BGP president. Now, sources tell Times now that in her conversation with the BGP uh, president, Vasundra Raje dismissed charges of resort politics and amplified that she is dedicated uh, to the party and will never dare to go against the party knobs. On the other hand, her supporters are rooting for her for the top post. Listen in. हमारे ये है कि ये हकीकत है कि हम वो समय देखते थे सुखाड़िया जी के टाइम में उस समय तो होता था किसके साथ कितने विधायक तब उस हिसाब से फैसले होते थे अब सब कुछ इस प्रकार से तय कर दिया हर पार्टी के अंदर कि पार्टी का केंद्रीय नेतृत्व तो है वो आपस में सलाह करता है फिर विधायकों से पूछताछ की जाती है तो उसमें जो भी चेहरा आएगा बिल्कुल सही होगा देखते क्या होता है क्या नहीं होता लेकिन हम मुख्यमंत्री के नाम को लेकर चर्चा चल रही है लेकिन राजस्थान में मैडम को इग्नोर नहीं किया सकता आप देख सकते हैं राजस्थान में बीजेपी के अंदर कोई और दमदार चेहरा है नहीं वसुंधरा राजे के अलावा और कोई है नहीं यदि वसुंधरा राजे को इग्नोर करते हैं तो भारतीय जनता पार्टी को भारी नुकसान होगा आने वाले लोकसभा चुनाव में भी होगा और भविष्य में भी आप देखना Now, even as uh, we get to all those details, the question is, who is in the pole position to become the chief minister? Well, we bring you the inside scoop. Sources tell Times now that Vasundra Raje, a prominent figure in the party, has no intention of causing a rift within the party, as alleged by the Congress. Instead, she desires to be an integral part of the party and carry forward the legacy of Vijaya Raje Sindhya. Additionally, she wants the party to acknowledge Raj Mata's sacrifice and show respect accordingly. Now, there is a possibility for Gajendra Shekhawat, who is a highly regarded uh, by the top brass, to come out on top. According to sources, Shekhawat's efforts to push down the unrest in Jaipur following the murder of Sukhdev Singh could work in his favor. Now, the BJP may have won three states, but the Congress reminds him of their ongoing past struggle over selecting a chief minister face. It says that the delay in appointing a suitable candidate is evidence of this internal conflict listen in to some of the voices it just goes to show that the process has been followed by the congress party they've realized that they have a bigger responsibility towards the electorate of telangana and they have given a face to the uh, person who would be responsible for taking forward all the commitments here we are seeing a process where two people in the center will decide who the chief minister will be you're seeing musical chairs happen, dissent happen, discussion happen, it's been four days and you're also seeing the situation in Rajasthan unfolding in Rajasthan and yet there is no accountability being decided. It's shameful that despite four days of uh, election results, you still don't have, more important states of uh, India do not have a chief minister. They have to listen to three members. They have to listen to 11 members. And they have to listen to them. They मुझे जो आशंका लगती है मैं नहीं मालूम कि भाजपा के अंदर जो अटल अडवाणी युग था उसमें जो बचे खुचे चेहरे हैं उनको समाप्त करके मोदी और अमित शाह के प्रतिबद्ध लोगों को मौका देने के लिए हो रहा है अगर कर पाएंगे तो वो करेंगे उन्हें भाजपा से ज्यादा चिंता अपनी तेलंगाना में कांग्रेस की मेजॉरिटी आई इस पांच विधानसभा के जो चुनाव हुए वो तुरंत फुरंत मुख्यमंत्री को शपथ दिला दी ये बताता है कि कांग्रेस हाई कमांड का जो कंट्रोल है वो पूरी तरह से वो है कोई इनफाइटिंग नहीं है क्योंकि बीजेपी में अब चार पांच दिन हो गए लेकिन अभी तक उनके विधायक दल की बैठक भी नहीं हो पाई तीनों जगह और एक इनफाइटिंग जैसी स्थिति मैं समझता हूं दिख रही है नाउ द ग्रैंड ओल्ड पार्टी सीम्स टू हैव कन्वीनियंटली फॉगटन 
in the absence of INDI stalwarts during a momentous occasion for Bremen Reddy and the Congress Party as they formed the government for the first time in Telangana. Although Gandhi's uh, two Congress CMs and a TMC representative were present, other top leaders of INDI gave the Congress Party a cold shoulder. In MP, Shivrat Singh Chauhan dropped a significant hint day before yesterday when we have to shift the focus from uh, Rajasthan to what is happening in MP. He reminded the voters that he worked relentlessly for 20 to 22 hours during the elections to secure the BJP's victory. He stressed that he only slept for two hours during the polls, but he recently said that he is not the front runner for the CM post and that he only wants to secure Mission 29 for Lok Sabha. देखो आज से हम शुरू कर रहे हैं मिशन मध्य प्रदेश का मिशन 29 मिशन 29 और मिशन 29 का मतलब है मध्य प्रदेश में लोकसभा की सीटें हैं 29 और मेरी दिल से इच्छा है और उसके लिए हम सब मिलके दी जान एक करेंगे जैसे विधानसभा के चुनाव में ये सुन ले मैं चैन की सांस नहीं लूंगा आप बताओ फिर से मोदी जी को प्रधानमंत्री बनाना है फिर से मोदी जी को प्रधानमंत्री बनाना है